Hey guys, what's up? And um, welcome back to my channel. It's Kay Bowman here. I'd like to say thank you for um, to join me on this brand new video. And I'll, uh, what can I say? You guys are so fabulous, and thank you ever so much for your support. It means a lot to me. But obviously, I'm so overwhelmed. But I still do my best to to improve my performance. So every so often, I have to check my channel analysis and see how much subscribe I got so far. But I need to get to 200. Hope you guys can't wait for that. So um, always remember to subscribe to my channel, turn this bell notification, and you always remember not to forget my latest video and the future video. It's something you quite notice through notifications. So first of all, I'll be doing another retro finds. So let's get started, shall we? Well then, let's start with those um, retro finds. So I have found, I have discovered Test Drive 4. Is this, which is um, a, a racing game from, which is released in 1997. This is a PlayStation 1 game. This this game, I never heard before, so sorry I discovered it. I'd think it was a treat today. And it only cost about five quid, so much cheaper. Um, you can obviously find some old PS1 games, especially if you can find those on eBay or car boot sales and antique stores, whenever you can find. It depends what condition, which is new condition. If it's mint or pristine condition, or like or new, which is still in factory, still still in sealed fact factory sealed wrap, and you can look carefully. You can look carefully. You can you can see the PlayStation logo, the top corner of that cover. And you can see those two racing cars. If you're quite familiar with those cars. And you look here, it says Test Drive 4 is a clear choice for best racing game of 1997. It's a really interesting quote on the top. And you can see, you can see them, a game company called we've Never Heard Of. It is called Accolade. Can you see it? On the bottom of this logo of Test Drive 4. And you can see here it's got well it's got hot soundtrack featuring Rita de Groff optional a youngster a younger and younger twenty eight. I don't think I supposed to hear that songs before. Are you familiar with those games? Um I do obviously like those video games like Grand Theft and I and Formula One. What else I remember, like Total Driving, and there's Toka Championship Racing. But it has a look here. You could look in the back cover, in the title it says Duty vs. Beast. Hmm, that's quite obvious. And you can see that you can see that you can see those screenshots. It's got like it tells you what scene. It's like I'm based on the gameplays around here. You can see the label at the top. It says "In Try Games Shot for EA Games." Also, it says here it's got. Pitbull, Senate Gates, and here, and you can see this spine cover. You can see you can see PlayStation on top. It says power on the bottom, and you can see fairly is test drive four. This case is you can see around. Here, you can also see it's got cable link link cable to consoles. And you can see in the label, you can say there's got you can you can look at these icons here. 
it's got one one block memory cards. But it's got capacity. It's got you can you can use like analog joystick controllers or and analog controller. You can dual shock. You can get two players. And um, let's tell you about let's tell you a bit more. Most racing games I mostly like, like Gran Turismo. I like Gran Turismo. Well, my favorite game, or my favorite Gran Turismo game, is Gran Turismo Two, which is my favorite game since childhood. I mem I remember I first released Street Chris PlayStation console ever back in the nineties. Um, since I was younger, I used to I I got res when I first played was Tekken Two, Tomb Raider, and Gran Turismo Two, and was Armageddon. And um this game this um this current console is quite unique. I do like PS1 games. Or well, it's short for PlayStation 1. Well simply originally called Sony PlayStation. Okay, look, let's have a look in here, description menu. You can see this menu, it's got English menu. You can I think I think you can this one you read instructions. This instruct description booklet is a look it looks so very this is a really good condition, I can tell. And and let's take a whole disc. And it's got a bit dusty, but just a tiny bit has got slight scratches. But perhaps later we can give it a try and I can test it to see how it works and but no problem. If not um complain. But you can you could use like you could use like disc restoration if you could do. You can make, you can do like um disc restorer, you can give it a good clean, make it nice and new again. But we can do that later. But I can give it a try to play this game for the first time. But I haven't played, I haven't heard this game before. And let's give you a quick recap before I finish this video about retro finds. And it says in the back here, it's a best racing game coming to PlayStation for this holiday season. The track looks, the tracks look great. The card models are best. We have ever seen. Gameplay and controls are palace. That's um that's from um appears to be from um play X play PlayStation Extreme. But it says PS Extreme, a shot for PlayStation Extreme. I think it's a magazine issue. It seems a bit. And if you're interested also um if you're interested to do it on the next video, but if you if you if would so um would you think about if it's if how see how fascinating about collecting old school video games as a finals collection? I think it's worth collecting them. You can obviously get on eBay, just like I said earlier. And okay, so that's it for. All. I hope you enjoyed this video and um I thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you enjoy hope you enjoy this video about reviewing and take a look at that retro game something more interesting. So um just like to say um don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification but this is important but do not miss out on future videos but it's really important for you guys. But you can obviously also you can check out my social links down below this video description. You can find me on Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest, and my Facebook page. If you are willing to support my exclusive content or behind the scenes, and if you're interested, like travel vlogs, travel blogs, and and if you're interested, like support my mug, like mugbang pictures and. If you're interested, 
and please feel, feel free to support me. And um, thank you very much and hope you see you on the next video.